advert at the boardwalk because it seemed like such a nice walk um, and it's something I've never done before so I'm going to walk it to Epcot and race to see who gets there first Holly stayed on the boat so she'll be there somewhere um, but it just looks really nice so I thought I'd see where the walk will take me <sighs> we took about five minutes I have heard someone say there was shade there was no shade very hot but I'm here now and I beat the boat so I win While we wait for Holly's boat to come around the corner, I think you can just see it now. Just thought I'd have a quick look at the construction. This is going to be for the Ratatouille ride. Um, if you've watched any of our Disneyland Paris vlogs, you'll know it's one of my favourites. I think made Holly, I made Holly ride it about three times last time we went. It was great. I like the little floating mice that you get into. Uh, but yeah, they're bringing it to France in Epcot. So I think that's open in a few years. But yeah, it looks like they're cracking on. And then this is the Skyliner which is almost done, the station. So hopefully that'll be done when we come back in 2020. Anyway, here's the boat now. We're next. Not that we've waited long. Yeah. 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 No, but just like Hello. and a happy birthday. No yeah. matter how exciting you look, you are this year. Yeah. All <laughs> birthday in the park. And there's a few brush of these people on as well. Yes. That's very good. Oh, here's yeah. what we're I was on Cherry Tree Lake this morning. The bases had a bit of trouble with them exploding kitchens. And Georgie thought that the best course of action would be to put on his belly. But it turns out he's in very healthy. It's all satisfying. Okay, so Mary Poppins has met Mary Poppins. We're going to cross the English Channel now into France, and uh, apparently, France has a, a show or a film. Impressions of France. Never heard of it before. Honestly, I, I didn't even know that such thing existed. And then on the days they said that it was the best thing ever, and we were like, what? What's that? So we're going to see if we can find it and watch it, and you know, hopefully it's aircon. The ride is literally, that can't have been open the last time we were here. There's no way we would have missed it. It's right there. That's crazy. Well, it's air-conned. Pardon? It's air-conned. Yeah, it's air-conned. Should be starting to like dark, which is nice. And no bugs. And no bugs. There's no bugs on <clears throat> Well, the film was okay. I mean, it's very pretty, but... I fell asleep. Okay, she fell asleep. The aircon was not nice. It was boring, but if you put me in a dark room with aircon and I'm comfortable and it's, you know, I just fall asleep. 
just look like England a little bit. And I suppose we live there, so. Okay, just to give you some sort of scale for size, on the right is Test Track, and on the left is the uh, Guardians of the Galaxy ride. Yeah, that's going to be pretty big, and Test Track is actually nearer to us at the minute than Guardians is. Attacked by bugs again. If you are um, a person that comes in minute, does this happen every year? And what do you do about it? How do you stop them from attacking you? Is there something we can buy or wear or something? Let us know. Okay, we made it as far as Italy and we're gonna have to stop for some foods but first we've seen a photo pass person at a bridge and you know why not so they has decided to go for the pizza Toscana from the premiere kitchen pizza Toscana with a little meatball sausage in there Nice. Mm. Oh. Disney Duck. Disney Duck. Doing whatever a Disney Duck can. It's just chilling. Oh my god, he's swimming now. That's so cute. I've got a sauerkraut hot dog. He let me order it in German. And do you know the German? Yeah. All right. I said, uh, I said, guten Tag. And he's, oh. I, said, I think it was a more informal hello. And I said, oh, I've been learning a very difficult fight. And I don't want to offend, but can I order in, Ger in, in Deutschland? Uh, and he said, yeah, yeah. And he said, yeah, what's your order? And I said, eine Sauerkraut, uh, eine Rotwurst mit Sauerkraut und ein Wasser. And then I think he said, cover water or bottle of water in German. And I went, uh, bottle. <laughs> and he said, yeah, so good, so good. Oh. You couldn't have just got a nice cup of water and save some money. It's three dollars and it's very cold and it's very hot. Iced water would have been equally as cold. Would you like some? Yeah, I would, want, I would like some. How is it? That's not the best from the South Cloud used to get. It's so good. Yes, very nice. Very sweet. I've never had South Cloud. You've never had sauerkraut? No. Oh, you're wild. And then the guy in front of me was going to order without, and his wife said, order with it because it, it keeps it authentic. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to do it. Oh. Uh, nice. I am going to bob off into that shop now because I feel like I'm about to die. Okay. Okay. So I've come into the shop in Germany and they have Swarovski in here. You can buy a glass slipper or a glass mini. Well, crystal. Tony <laughs> Castle. It's one hundred and twenty dollars. Mm -hmm. 
Shoehorn into the corner. Yeah. The refreshment outpost, but yes, it's all very African. Um, and then what's up next? China. China. China's up next. Let's have a look around China. I wonder if there's some Chinese food I can get because I'm still hungry. Still hungry? Yeah. Let's see if there's any uh, cute little Chinese dishes in the flower and garden. What are the baby pandas? That one's playing. Oh, they're so cute. And Vanellope are out. We think they're in like the Imagination Pavilion area, so we're just going to try and make our way through to there. Um, and we'll see if they're there, but hopefully they are, and we don't care if it's a long wait because it's aircon. We have not experienced this kind of heat since we first came because it's not like this when we come like later on in the year. So every water point we've stopped at. Well, it's just good practice. Trying to stay hydrated. Better not let a uh, poo bear know that there's a honey stall here because he'll um, eat all the honey and there'll be none left. I don't think he'd be happy that they're selling it for a profit. No, probably not. Honey is for bears. Who bears? They just got some of these. They were free, they were giving them out on the walk so maybe it's because it's hot or maybe it's because they're fruit and it's flower and garden, I'm not really sure but they're cold and so we're gonna have them anyway. We yeah, are just heading up to Image work, so I can see it there. Oh, to go and meet Ralph and Vanellope. Just met Ralph and Vanellope. Woo! Nice and aircon, and it was actually really good. Yeah, it was quite good actually. So now. Well, it seems like a long queue, but it won't really a long way. There's only so much you can do with them. Yeah. They were like hurrying people along really, weren't they? There was a really good cast of them because of Megan who was like talking to everybody who was waiting and she was really cute and she knew that I was dressed like Mary. And then she said to me on the way out, bye Mary Poppins. She was like, oh my god, you're wearing smart shoes. You're definitely a good nanny. And I was like, oh, you know. Nice to have a little interaction with them, isn't it? The clock has finally wound down and it's time for soaring. So we're heading into the land. and the fast pass line. Okay. On the doors to your flight open, please take a seat. <laughs> Store all carry-on items in the underseat compartment. This includes cameras, purses, hats, and of course, these little dudes. Next, oh, we did Sauron. Amazing. Yeah, it was um, it was a long fast pass wait though, considering the ride wait was 45 minutes, we waited 30. When we got out, the ride time was 80. Uh, obviously a lot of fast pass 
Yeah, so I think something may have gone wrong. Yeah. Anyway, we are officially done with our park legs. And we've got a brand new resort and hotel room to explore that we've not even walked into yet. Yeah, it's strange to think that we're going to home to somewhere else today. And we'll be there tomorrow and then we'll be leaving again and we'll be going home. But So we're gonna head out now. Portland's Riverside is number four, so for once it's actually quite close. Yay! I bet Adam will not really far away though. <laughs> So this is our room, this is our garden view room at Port Orleans Riverside. So air con under the window as normal. Oh but we've got nice blinds and look at these curtains. Our garden view is just the bushes that are outside really. It's not really a garden if I'm honest. Nice table and two chairs as usual, big mirror. And then this is a massive piece of furniture some drawers and a cupboard and I'm guessing there's a fridge in here yay and yeah it's just a standard fridge it's not as nice as the one at Caribbean it's not got like a glass front or anything but it'll do and here we've got a coffee maker oh we've got the Mickey's 90th anniversary blend coffee Whoa. or not um, with some glasses and a nice thing and some coffee and the TV and the pots um, are actually here to our HDMI cable um, although there's not HDMI oh no there is it says digital video in the TV so that's convenient we've got a lovely stool here and a shelf with some hangers we've got two double beds and then a little thing in between and lamps above the beds. I did have to put all the lights on when I came in because there were no lights on. Um, or the main main light, which is that one there. Um, and it's not that bright. So, bathroom. Double sinks, which is really cool. And two mirrors, double mirrors. And I love this, this is like, matches the countertops, this tissue box. And uh, we've got some facial soap and some body lotion. Um, wardrobe bit, shelf, spare pillow, iron, ironing board, one of these really thin safes, bins, I don't know, is that a food bin? I don't, I don't really know. Um, storage under here, hair dryer, some spare towels, and then bathroom mirror, or door mirror should I say. It's a full length mirror there. Toilet. Oh, that's a nice shower curtain. It's like, can you see it? It's like, hmm, double colour. Um, little tubby bath thing, as always, although these tiles are really nice. Um, and then these built-in toiletries. And that is about it. So we're gonna have a little rest now because we are exhausted. Then we might go and have a look on the resort. Okay, we focus now. Hello, everybody. So we have been at the resort for a couple of hours. David had a little nap. I don't know how. Do you mean you don't know how? I just closed my eyes and woke up when it was 40 minutes later. 40 minutes? Yeah. It's been longer than that. I woke up it was quarter to seven. Right, okay. You think you've been awake since quarter to seven and it's 20 half past seven now? Yeah. You've been awake for 10 minutes. <laughs> anyway, so um, we we're gonna go to the um what's it called? To Burt Wright's dining hall, no. Uh, to Burt Wright's dining hall, which is like quick service. It's uh, major behind the scenes. Port Orleans Riverside. Oh yeah, it's a bit weird this, isn't it? Um to get something to eat. Um because I was starving my face off, but then David fell asleep. So I was like doing some moving and packing and all that business. I don't know what you're pointing at. Service and vehicles, authorised vehicles only. 
Oh, well, why are we driving through here then? Because my sat nav told me to. Oh, uh, well, I suppose it's tough, really, isn't it? I think it's right in this road. So, um, yeah, I just got busy and David had a nap. And then, really, we're like, we basically, I got a notification that there was a new Team Dragon video from the outlet at Vineland. Lucy is so loud. Um, and we were like, you know what, should we go to the outlet, outlet one more time? Because actually, we haven't got the, any of the little boys in our lives anything. Um, and that's usually our priority. And we haven't really got that much Disney anything. Um, so we thought we'll just pop one last time, see if there's any like play sets or anything that we can get. And if there isn't, then we'll find something, you know, on site tomorrow, maybe Animal Kingdom, or even if it's on our last day, although hopefully it won't be because, you know, packing. Um, so we just thought we'll pop to the outlet and that like gives some inspiration. And since we were going off site, we may as well eat off site because it's, you know, substantially less money. So, and when we were going through the China Pavilion today, I was like, yeah, I want some Chinese food. And then got like so hot and bothered that I was like, no, I don't want to eat anymore. I just, you know, uh, I just want to lay down or be in a pool or something. Um, but I'm still craving Chinese food. So we're going to go to Panda Express. Well, we hope we're going to go to Panda Express <laughs> because we're, I tried to put, I tried to be fancy with the sat nav and put like, the outlet in as our destination, but then put like a via panda. Yeah, like a via route in, but it didn't. Um, it didn't think Panda Express was the place. I thought Panda was the place. It said it searched for nine hundred miles and there was nothing called that. <laughs> so um, you know, I don't, I don't know. Maybe maybe there aren't any anymore. Maybe they're all gone. <laughs> Yeah, well, um, we'll see what we get. I don't want to say, yeah, we're going to Panda Express, and then actually we end up somewhere completely different, because that's usually what happens. But I know where we won't be going. We will not be going to Taco Bell. No, no, definitely not. Because that was horrendous. 